guys, it's Megan. So today I wanted to talk to you about has moving here helped me lose weight? Obviously it's a different lifestyle, it's a different place. Have I gained weight? What's, what's going on there? So does New York basically help you lose or gain weight? So I have been here almost officially two months. My whole lifestyle was completely different in Kansas City. So I worked as a waitress slash in retail. Honestly, most of my day was standing. I did a lot of running around walking during the lunch shift when I was a waitress, but a lot of my day was standing for eight to nine hours a day. It really sucked and it really wasn't great on my knees, my body, didn't do a lot of good for me, unfortunately. So I had that job, I had the standing job, which was one of the reasons it was hard for me to give it up because I didn't want to be sedentary and it's hard for me to motivate myself to exercise, which I need to get better at doing. So I was on my feet for eight to nine hours. I would drive to work, so that was sitting. I would drive home. I would either be sitting on the couch or sitting out eating with friends or something, which was the other half of my day. So, you know, I wasn't sedentary. I was a very active person, just like I am here just a very active person in general. And then what I would eat there, I would eat healthy in the morning, I would eat yogurt or oatmeal or something like that, have my coffee, of course, um, and then I would eat a huge, huge meal at like three o'clock after the lunch shift. I would eat like not really great stuff, it was like Swiss German comfort food, so big heavy like pasta and like um, meat always. And then I would have cake for dessert every single day that I worked there. Again, not very healthy, and then I really wouldn't eat later. So not the greatest lifestyle, obviously. I figured New York would be a great way to change. So when I first moved here, I lost like seven pounds right off the bat, mainly because the stress of moving here, and then, you know, I didn't really know where to eat. Honestly, that sounds weird, but I didn't. I was walking a lot because I was trying to explore the city, so I lost weight very quickly. Then I discovered pizza and Chinese food and I put it back on pretty quickly. So I would say the end of August, I was like, okay, I need to rethink this whole situation. I'm settled, I know where things are, I need to kind of redo everything. I um, still eat the same breakfast, I eat yogurt, oatmeal, coffee, and then I, and then so for lunch, I try to eat healthier. I try to eat like a big salad or like a sandwich, or um, I'll do chipotle with just rice and beans. I don't do meat. I try to like keep it low calorie on that end. Um, you know, like a sandwich, soup from Panera, salad, whatever, stuff like that. Stuff that's very healthy. And then I'll eat light again for dinner, like a light salad, light sandwich, something like that. But this is also different for me. I have an internship where I'm sitting eight hours a day. I don't really get up except for lunch except for her to maybe move around. Um, I do that two days a week and then the rest of my job. So that one's mostly sedentary. We do get up and walk around. I do run errands for that job. So it's a little more active, but it's still mostly sedentary. But the factor that changed is my commute. I walk, I stand on the subway, I go up and down stairs constantly. So it's a completely different kind of experience because I'm walking so much more. It's very easy for me to get five to 10,000 steps a day just commuting. Walking up and down the stairs has helped build my muscle. It's helped me, I feel stronger. I feel like, you know, more in shape, definitely. And since I've been eating healthier, I've actually dropped four pounds again. So I'm back into my range of where I want to be. So I am five pounds down from what I was averaging in Kansas City. So yes, New York has gotten me in shape, mainly from me walking everywhere and going up and down the stairs, but I did have to control my diet. Now I can eat more food because I'm walking, commuting, hustling, stuff like that. Um, so I've learned what I can eat and the amount of food I can eat here um, to maintain my weight. I was at an unhealthier weight for me personally in Kansas City, working as a waitress, eating sweets every day, which I'm glad I don't really do that anymore. I don't really eat sweets 
maybe like once a week. So I'm glad I kicked that habit. Uh, it helps definitely not working in a bakery and being around that food constantly, around sweets, all of that. Yeah, it's been really great moving here. I'll keep you updated on what keeps happening, but I do think New York can really whip you into shape and can help you lose weight. Or you can do the opposite and eat a lot because there's a lot of good restaurants and a lot of good food here, which I'm still trying to get an experience. And I don't deny myself that. On the weekends, I let myself go crazy and have a couple cheat meals because why not? It's really good and you know, I eat healthy most of the week, so it's fine. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.